Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm so excited. I am on the road. It is official. We are out of here. And you see, I did break down and bring the boys. I couldn't leave them home. I thought about it. My son was going to watch them. And um, when I took them outside for their last use the bathroom, Biggie Smalls jumped right in the car. <laughs> He was like, you are not leaving me here. So, get riding. It's a beautiful day. I've got about a six hour drive um, to get to the spot that I'm staying at tonight. So, I'm just getting started. So I got a long way to go. <laughs> but I'll keep you guys posted along the way. Good morning, everybody. How's everybody doing today? I hope everybody's having a good day. Welcome back to the channel. So I didn't vlog last night. Um, I pulled into camp last night. I didn't drive very far. I was kind of tired. I had been up since 5.30 and did some gardening and all kind of stuff at home. So I got a late start. So I just drove for a few hours, looked up a campground <laughs> and came here. Um, I just want to show you where I'm camping. It's absolutely beautiful. I'm upstate New York. Um, I can't remember the name of the campground, but I'll tell you in a little bit. So there's the van. And this is the site. It's so beautiful here. And I'm right on the river. So I'm going to walk down and show you. So peaceful. I had a great night. There were deer running around everywhere. First night in the van. I slept well. Biggie was a little rambunctious and not used to it, but he settled down eventually and went to sleep. So we made out fine for the first night in the van. It's a little different than being in the RV, but I was very comfortable in my bed. Ugh. And look at this, guys. Once I pulled up and saw the river, I decided I'm gonna spend another night because it's just gorgeous here. absolutely beautiful and I love listening to the river at night I slept with my hatch open and just listened to the water all night and somebody dammed this up with rocks right here so there's an actual little pool where you could sit and keep cool and I'll show you the rest of the grounds. When I go back up top, there's showers, there's a saltwater pool. It's a really nice campground. I'm definitely gonna come back here. This might be a new spot. And the camp spots all come with a little fire pit and they have little grates and picnic table. And you can see there's another spot and there's RVs over in there. There's all type of campers. Some are tenting, some have RVs. It's a mixed bag. Oh, and there's electric and water on all of these sites. And it was $15 per person. <laughs> just sitting here relaxing and I wanted to show you the um, netting that I have is working out perfectly it's those um, magnetic um, net that you buy that can go over your door or your garage door 
I bought those, I opened the hatch and I just bought a bunch of little small magnets and it sticks right to the outside of my van and I can leave the hatch open, no bugs. And if you're interested in where I got them from, let me know in the comments and I will drop a link for you. And I know it doesn't look the prettiest, but I couldn't find any to fit my van windows, but they sell the mesh um, window covers. And I just bought two sets and they've got little magnets on them too. And it lets me be able to have the windows down and no bugs. And this is the salt water pool I was telling you about earlier. And that building up there is laundry, bathrooms, and the showers. And you can see other people camping. And there's one of the offices. And ice, a little basketball court, really cool wooden bench. Isn't that cool? It's all wood. It's handmade. Now I'm out just walking the dogs, getting them some exercise. It's really a nice little campground, guys. And this is the name of the campground. And this is the name of the campground. I really recommend this place, guys, and the people are really nice. And they have everything you need here. <laughs>